Right, um, hello again. This is another test. Um, the CPU seems to be okay with normal quality, so I guess we can try. Right, I'm playing as Wendy and I have just found the something like that. A gold reception. Right. I have a divining rod and an axe. Might as well kill some stuff with it. Oh hey, the CPU is mysteriously acting up. Well, whatever. It's, it seems to be a temporary thing. In any case, yeah, I just, I just bought this game. It's a lot of fun. I'm, I'm normally not really into the survive kind of games, but this one has a lot of charm to it. I'm just gonna gather some supplies. I'm not sure what is expected of me at this point, but you know. Flowers are always good. I can tell I need to find a few things using the defining rod. First, I'm just making sure I have some stuff with me in case, you know, things go awry. Things go wrong. Like that, yeah. Apparently, my quote unquote scary voice can summon lightning. Right, the defining rod. The source is distant. By the way, this character, Wendy, I believe, I, I find her to be quite amusing. She is on the line between cute and creepy, basically. I'll try to invest some serious time in searching now. I'm kind of surprised there isn't any snow. Every person I've I've seen play this faced off against winter, but I see I seem to be lucky somehow. So maybe that's a good sign, or maybe that's a sign I'm going to get screwed over later. Whatever the case might be. Oh, a pig. Standoffish. Okay, sure. Um, I actually tried this once before, and I got killed by some less than friendly pigs. Like ones that attack you by default. What I like about this game, I just keep discovering new stuff. I've seen several Let's Plays, but that that hasn't made this uninteresting. Because, like, the first time I played, I saw things I hadn't seen before. Uh, so yeah, it's a very rich game. Also, this is my dead twin sister, Abigail. That's very unsettling. I guess we all have our quirks, you know, some, some people have strange taste in music, some people have a weird voice, some people have a dead twin sister that visits them at night, you know. I don't seem to be making much progress. I guess I'll just keep picking stuff up. Because I got 
get 12 flower petals, I can make myself a delightful hat. Well, it's not really a hat. Garland. That's not a word I, I've ever heard before, but in case. You kid, isn't she cute? Just checking the map real quick. Uh, frauds. They they stole my items the last time I met them, so I'm gonna steer clear. Oh, those things, they are the bane of my existence, Talbots. Oh, I'm burning through a whole colony of the damn beasts. Why couldn't lightning hit one of them? That would be beautiful. I've actually seen lightning hit a bunny once, but... I don't know, I just think it would be much more entertaining if they hit a Talbert. Right. The wicked this draws closer. That sounds exciting. Oh, um right. Yes, it's fire time. It's a fire. Be sure to enjoy stating the obvious. <sighs> While I'm here, I might as well just do some stuff. Mining at the edge of the darkness. I... I too like to live dangerously. Oops. When the character says something like that, that means they'll be dead in a few seconds. Or less. Right. Stomach is not doing too bad, but could always be better. Whoops. Let's have a bite to eat. Shut up, Abigail. I, I like her her quote when the fire is too too hot basically it's like a vision of hell <laughs> don't know why I like that I just do she just manages to make something negative out of everything right so my CPU is doing fairly well. At least I think it is. It says perfect streaming over here, so unless it's lying to me, which it might, you know. It wouldn't be the first time the software had lied to me. But so far, so good. Just collected some supplies in case I need them. Doll bird. Oh no, go away. I envy his escape. <laughs> Dang. Seriously. Ooh, supplies. Good supplies. What the hell is that? Rot. Not touching that. <laughs> I also like her, her quote for manure. Life is blood and this. <laughs> hmm. 
In general, I like the characters in this game. They have a lot of personality. I also like the, that they went for like playing an instrument over when the characters talk. It's charming, and I realize I should have been holding my defining rod for a while. Oh, well, I stupidly walked into the right direction. Huzzah for mindless stupidity. Something wicked is here. A garden gnome. That is wicked. <laughs> Box thing. Right. It contains a vital spark. I seem to have discovered a an important part of whatever I need to do. Oh, right. It's the evil piggies. Defend. Oops. These are some aggressive piggies right there. Let's see. Even that is not perfect. For king. For king and country. Right, these guys killed me last time. Why are you after me? Why must you be so mean? Um, I'm sure I made a pickaxe, but I can't find it, so... Silly me. Losing items. Mysterious. Right, just gonna collect some more supplies, in case I wanna make a fire pit, instead of just a campfire. At least, can I? Oh, I, I still need wood. Well... That's problematic. One second. Whoops. For a moment there, I thought I, I thought I lost the recording software, but it's still here, so... <clears throat> it's already evening again. Yeah, so far, I, f I found a lot of niter, but I'm not sure what to use it for, really. Uh, so far, in not a single playthrough have I actually used it. But, oh well. Yeah, yeah I know. A sleep dart. Should be useful. I'm gonna... Uh, no, I'm not gonna wear that. I'm gonna wear this. A fashionable hat. Where will the Divining Rod lead me next? Hmm. See, so yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm looking for. A spider. I'm going to murder spiders just for the sake of I shall send you the next that is a pretty awesome free mortal one liner. Considering this speaker seems to be a young girl. Children these days, they grow up too fast. Well then again, she's probably not a little girl. Wilson is not not, not a little boy, so. Well whatever, I dunno. I am not aware of the age of the characters in this game. Right, the final rod. Also, I realize I'm not taking good care of myself, and... Uh, 
Oh. <laughs> okay, that was a completely lucky shot. I am alive by sheer luck, ladies and gentlemen. Lightning strike saved me. Well, that's... that's something, at least. <clears throat> Didn't figure lightning would save me at some point. Would have been sad if I just lost. Because... yeah. Because I failed to build a torch. That was pretty shameful how I completely missed. I missed a button. Aha. Fire. Ow. The darkness has. Oh, I can build another one. That's fortunate. Or else it would have been another obnoxious situation. Daylight has returned, and I need to stop taking stupid risks. Better get some some logs right away. Right. I like the look of the evergreen trees, even though I'm going to cut them down. Or it. Singular. Right, right, right. This is where I found the box thing. Uh, let's see. I'll just equip the defining rod again. And see what there is left to find. This all seems to be leading into the ocean, so I guess I'll take a left here. Oh yeah, my stomach almost forgot. Um, seem to have much food on me. I do have some monster meat, but... Oh, dead end. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Hmm. I wonder where the other stuff is, then. Seeds. I guess I can't be picky. Had a bit of a frame rate drop there. I could attack the beehive to win some honey. On the other hand, that might be a terrible idea. Also, lightning keeps striking nearby, which is slightly unfortunate. Does the defining rod cause lightning to strike nearby, perhaps? That would be interesting. Beefalo. It's just one. Oh, there's actually seven. What, what, are, they, what are they doing? Oh, <laughs> okay, this is beautiful. I'm taking a screenshot of this. There. It's a beautiful day. The sun is shining. I feel good. Beefalo are awesome. Oh, yeah. Right. <clears throat> the beefalo just gave me my best don't starve moment, wherein they killed a tall bird. I will consider that some sweet revenge for all the trouble they've caused me. Well, it's just one, but, you know, one step at a time. The 
darkness will be here soon. And the night is dark and full of terrors. Oh, right. Gonna set up a fire pit here. Because we're gonna have some food. Om nom 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 nom. Gotta eat a tall bird egg. Your children are mine to consume. Right. I seem to be doing okay now. Well, I'm gonna drop this and this. I need the space. I can buy a uh, buy. Buy? Yeah, sure. At the local store. Yeah, I think I can build, I should say, a science machine, but... Oh, I... No, I can't. And I should have seen that as I was saying it, but I didn't. I must not be paying attention or something. The glue encroaches. Right, well, it's getting to be pretty late. It's at the end of day three. I found a box thing. I think I'm gonna close it off here. Thanks for watching. Um, tune in next time and we will try to find another thing. Possibly box shaped, possibly not. See you then.